Okay, folks, this is probably the 40th time I shoot this video, trying not to rant, but I don't think I'm going to make it. <laughs> this is the final cut, whatever it is it is. And this is, yes, a video that I wish I didn't have to do. I used to enjoy hacks when Power BI was one, two years old. Now they are not cute anymore. It just upsets me <laughs> deeply. Let's get started. I'll show you. Okay, so... Let me show you what the issue is. I have here a simple table with dates and sales for the North Wind database, okay? And I want to filter this by last week. Show me the sales for last week. I always forget these things and get upset all over again. <laughs> so I said, okay, what you can do is you can grab the column date, the relative date, beautiful, one week, calendar week, apply filter, and it always threw me off. It's like, okay, if you are anywhere else in the world that is not the US, weeks start on Monday. So in Power BI world, weeks start on Sunday and there is no freaking way to change it. You might say, oh, if I change the regional settings on the file, it'll do it. It won't do it. It won't do it. It's like, oh my God. This problem has been there for like six, seven years. Like for, for the longest time Power BI existed, it's still not fixed. It's disrespectful for anybody that does not live in the US. And I am ranting again. Okay, so I was thinking, oh, well, okay, if it doesn't work with this, surely, surely, if I put date and I use the, the date filter, this will work, right? How could it not? <laughs> so... <laughs> If you go here, relative date, put calendar weeks, one, the same thing. You're like, oh my god. It, uh, I, I need to seriously breathe because I'm, I'm getting red with anger. The, how to fix it? I'm going to show you. I don't want this just to be a rant. Breathe. So you go to, there are different ways. I found the easiest way is to do like this. You go add custom column, and then people wonder why the performance in Power BI is bad. This makes performance in Power BI bad. All the custom columns, all the custom back stuff that needs to be done just to hack the tool to death. I don't understand it. Why they don't fix it? Previous week, you go here and you do date is in previous. Don't you dare put the dot there, because it won't work. It's been this from day one, still not working. Previous week, and then I'm going to put date. And this is going to do true or false in Power Query for which are the actual weeks. Guess what? These will respect the regional settings. It's just amazing. And then you turn this into true or false. I guess you know what I'm going to do now. You go to close and apply. Now you have created a column that you shouldn't have to, it shouldn't have to be needed to filter this thing. Breathe through. Breathe. <laughs> so previous week, and then you do true, and then voila, you have your previous week. But this is absurd. There's an idea in the ideas forum. If somebody reads that, I don't see why, but you cannot see the votes anymore, probably so we don't get as upset as I'm getting. And it hasn't been fixed for six, seven years. This is not okay. This is just not okay. This needs to be fixed yesterday. Like, if I would send a bill to Microsoft for all the hacks that I have to make, and all of you would do the same, we will ruin them. It will go down faster than Twitter is going down. So <laughs> what's going on? Please, fix this stuff. It's just annoying. It's... It's so annoying. End of rant. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.